Hello, Tab Nation. It's your boy, Tom. And today, well, actually, like last week, I decided I wanted to brush up on my JavaScript, HTML, CSS uh, coding just because I haven't really played with them in a while. And I don't want to get rusty, you know, plus I like exploring new things and stuff. So <clears throat> this was just going to be a fun project at first, but then it kind of blew up into this whole thing. And I wanted to... You know, this is mostly an HK channel, so I was wondering how can I make it at least somewhat related to HK? I just realized I have code on my face. <laughs> my green screen is a pain because I moved and I haven't done the lighting yet. So yeah, I this everything in here, Notepad++, is all the code for a Chrome extension that I made that has to do with auto hotkeys so i'm considering it in alpha right now and then i want to get your feedback on ideas any bugs you find so in the description below if you want to email me to be part of the alpha testing just shoot me an email like i said it's in the description below let me know why you're emailing me uh, we'll just for now call this the hk chrome extension by tab nation or whatever as long as i know what you're referring to and give me like a day or two and I'll email the extension to everybody. So real quick, when you get the file, you're going to need to unzip it, go into Chrome, go to, well, mine says update right now, but the three little dots, you're going to go down to more tools and extensions. And when you come here, you're going to say load unpacked, and you're going to find the folder that everything's in so the folder is here and I would say select folder and it'll upload I'm not gonna do it because I already have it installed but it'll show up right here <clears throat> right now it's just called version 1 uh, if a new version comes out every so often I'll email you again and you put the folder in the same place same name or whatever you can do it this way also or you can just do update and it should just update on the fly really quick. Um, so we can actually, um, oop, where'd that go? So here's the extension. Once it's installed, it's going to be just the green HK uh, logo. I might change that to something else. But yeah, you're basically just going to uh, click on that. And this is kind of like the landing page, I guess I'm calling it for now. So you can select which version of code you're going to be coding in. So let's say we're in version one. And this, the way I'm looking at this is kind of like a Google search, but for AHK. <clears throat> so I can type in send, for example, something simple. Oh, I forget how send looks. You can push search and we have V1 checked. And it's going to take you straight to the V1 code, as you see here, for that command. So it's just a faster way to kind of find your way around. That's why I'm calling it kind of like the Google 4HK. Now, we have some other things here. Let's say this would be more for documentation reading, but let's say you're more of a YouTube watcher. Obviously, here you are watching this video. You can search all of YouTube. You can search Tab no Nation, and I put Joe in there. I do have a few more that are going to be added here. If you have a favorite person or you know someone's better at something than the other person, um, you can do the same thing. You can just type in uh, send. Let's go with Tab Nation because that's my channel. And we're going to push search. And it just does the search for you, basically. So here's, you know, some send video I did uh, a while back, four months ago. I guess not that while back. So it's going to help find stuff pretty easily. Uh, let's say you just want to get to my channel or Joe's channel and the other ones I'm going to add and you don't want to do a search. Maybe you're just looking for a random video. You can push, you know, let's do the automator. And it's going to just take you straight to Joe's page, straight to my page. I have a few more I'm going to be adding. And uh, yeah, you know, if you know some that you would like to see added, let me know. Uh, sites. Sites is same thing, just faster ways to get to places. You got uh, my website, Joe's website, uh, the Facebook group for AHK, the forums, Reddit, Discord. All of these are going to take you straight to those landing pages for AHK. Uh, in case you want to jump to something real quick, maybe you have a question, you need to go to Reddit. You just push this, boom. 
you're on uh, Reddit's AHK page. So yeah. Next for this, we have our drop down here. If there's something I should add to this, let me know. So we got more sites. So we got stuff like Stack Overflow, uh, Cloud AHK, V1 to V2 converter, and then we have some tool tools that can help you with programming. Uh, I actually just realized I need to add a pullover to this list because that would be a great one to do. And then about just kind of gives notes about what I've been doing uh, lately. You know, what was in the last update, stuff I'm planning to do, that kind of thing. Next, you can push the little house icon here, or even the text, actually. And this is going to take you to a full page. And as you see, not much to see here yet. This is the part that I'm really still working on. Uh, so there's a few things here. My email is actually down here also. So if you need that uh, for bugs, you want to volunteer to help out with alpha testing, definitely let me know. I'll give a shout out in that about tab to people who, you know, really help me out and stuff. I can use the username or your username or your real name in case you don't want it. Uh, so here we kind of have like some of at least stuff I use a lot. You know, instead of me coding, I need to toggle if you can select it and say display and it automatically gives you the code. And then you can either, you know, highlight, push control C or you can just push clipboard and it's now on my clipboard. Next, we got a uh, pop-out mode. Pop-out mode is what we just saw, but in a new window without like all the other stuff. So I call this pop-up mode in case you want to put it over the side of your um, IDE you're using. Now, the reason it pops up full screen like that is because Chrome won't allow you to use JavaScript to manipulate the size of a window for security reasons. So unfortunately, you got you got to resize it yourself. Kind of a pain, but hey, nothing I can do about that. Uh, so yeah, if you have more examples that you think should be added, because I obviously don't have very many here yet, let me know. I'd be glad to ask, uh, add pretty much anything I can, as long as it's not something like send. I don't really need that as an example, but, you know, regex, I have some regexes in here. Uh, you know, run as admin, that kind of stuff. So real easy copy and paste. HK Playground, that's going to take you to another site. Now, this is definitely new and has a long ways to go. Uh, it's kind of like that part you just saw there. The difference here is it's going to have some buttons, which I probably will have to drop, change the drop down because that would be too many commands to fill up this page. It would just be simpler to have categories. So you can do like, oh, I need a, a toggle if. But then you want to add, you know, send. Uh... You know, and you can just add code. So it's almost kind of like a macro recorder, but it's not actually recording. You're just pushing buttons to slowly build your code. Now, this has a long ways to go. Oh, you can clear and copy also. Yeah, this definitely has a long ways to go. You can resize the window too, just in case you guys want something crazy. You have some ridiculous regex or sentence that's going on there. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, you know, let me know what you think, stuff I'm missing, any problems you find. Uh, what I plan to do is once I'm really happy with this and I want to consider it like out of beta or out of alpha and I want to go to maybe beta testing, you know, do a little beta testing. And then this is actually going to be launched on the actual Chrome extension website. So it'll be available then through everybody uh, versus me having to email it to you. So you'll be able to find it once it goes to like full release. Uh, so that'll be great. You know, if you like this video, definitely hit that like. Uh, helps me out, you know, get the word out about this. Uh, and uh, oh yeah, hit that subscribe button because I'm always doing AHK videos. Sometimes I branch out because you should branch out at some point. Also, maybe you master it AHK. I'm never really going to do full on depth in two other languages. Like I might do five videos of JavaScript or something at some time or NIM. Uh, there's a few other ones out there, but those are just there to give you an example of what else exists out there. And then you can just find, you know, classes or another channel that's more focused on, you know, JavaScript or whatever. But I like to introduce you all to something new. All right. Description. We'll have that email address. Hit me up. I'll wait probably one or two days and send out a mass email and uh, try to keep you guys up to date every so often. I'm not going to, every time I make a change or add something, I'm not going to do another release. That would just be spamming you. I'll, I'll do it maybe like 
every so many changes that I do. So yeah. All right, everybody. Thank you for watching. See you on the next one.